here with H.A. Humpy Wheeler and the announcement today is Speedway Benefits Coming to Life. Tell us a little bit about what this program is. Well, it's a program that basically puts most of the 1,500 short tracks across the country together in an alliance to uh, sell advertising on a collective basis so that the short tracks who have been on the short end of getting the advertising dollars will be able to get some substantial ones because we'll go to a soft drink company or someone and uh, uh, pitch them on having uh, five or 600 tracks. They don't have to do anything except through us. We do all the work for them. And then we spread the money back out among, among the tracks. And then also we're going to do collective buying for them where we'll, uh, uh, instead of buying one roll of toilet paper, they'll buy, uh, uh, we'll buy maybe uh, a thousand gross for, 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 and divvy them out to the tracks. And other staples that all tracks pretty much spend uh, the same, at whether you're at uh, Spud Speedway in Maine or you're out uh, in Skagit in the state of Washington. Uh, so it's going to benefit, uh, they're going to save them money on the expense end, and it's going to raise revenues considerably. In addition, we're going to give them ideas every month on how to put more people in the grandstand, how to get more teenagers in, for instance, uh, how to get uh, uh, those video-enhanced kids that are 9 and 10 years old away from their machines and uh, out to the speedway. Uh, so we think we're going to help them uh, put some more people in seats. This has nothing to do with sanctioning racing, though, does it? Not at all. Uh, it's just an alliance, kind of like the corn farmers did after World War II, where they got together and uh, uh, to, to buy better and uh, also to uh, uh, be able to, re to, to grow, their, grow the corn better. And we're going to give them ideas, you know, like I said, on how to do things. But it's not a sanctioning body in any way, shape, or form. We'll be working with all the sanctioning bodies. We will not go after the big tracks, though, uh, the Charlottes, Daytonas, et cetera. Uh, this is strictly going to be short tracks. I know you've kicked around this idea in the back of your mind for a few years. Why now? I think because the economy uh, has... People keep uh, expecting the economy to pole vault uh, out of its mire, and it hasn't. And so, and it looks like it's going to be a while before that happens. So something needed to be done, and uh, we kept talking to short track promoters and kept saying, there's a problem here that can, we can help. And so I think this is a perfect time to do it. The worst times, sometimes the best time to do something. If there's a track promoter out there looking to reach out to Speedway Benefits, what's the best way to get in touch with you? Well, uh, we've got a website now, speedwaybenefits.com, or uh, they can call um, uh, uh, the number that's on the website, and, or they email us, and it's on the website, and uh, we'll get right back to them.